Hello, today we are going to mention how to make age and gender prediction with OpenCV. This is going to be our reference study. Those state of the art age and gender prediction models are designed by the researchers of the ETH Zurich. It stands for Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Zurich. Here you can find pre-trained models. We are going to use the apparent age prediction model and gender prediction model. Age prediction model is the winner of the LIP challenge, which stands for the looking at people challenge. Here, proto.txt files store the model structures, whereas coffee models store pre-trained weights. I already installed the proto.txt and coffee models for apparent age estimation and gender prediction models. In my environment, I'm going to use deep neural networks model of OpenCV and it comes from OpenCV contribution Python distribution. That's why you are expected to install those packages on your environment. And I'm going to import OpenCV. H model is going to be OpenCV dot deep neural networks dot read network from cafe and this function expects and proto txt files and copy models as well h dot proto txt is my model structure and uh, this is the pre-trained weights of the h model similarly i'm going to build the gender model and it's going to be a coffee model as well here gender.proto.txt file is the model structure whereas gender.coffee model is going to be the pre-trained weights now i'm going to read the image to make age and gender prediction open cv dot read and here i'm going to pass the path of the image the face Tests, tests, dataset, and image one.jpg. Let's show the image. I'm going to import matplotlib.pyplot to show the image. Here, plt.imshow and call and pass image here. The image is in blue because OpenCV reads an image in the reverse direction of the RGB. We can handle this just like that. Here I need to focus on the just facial area of the fat image. Luckily OpenCV provides a face detector. Detector path is in my environment is here and detector is going to be opencv dot cascade classifier and here i'm going to pass the detector path let's find the faces in an image face is going to be detector dot detect multi scale and here pass the base image we are going to pass scale factor and mean neighbors arguments to do detect multi scale function here 1.3 is the scale factor and 5 is the mean neighbors values let's see the font face this is the coordinate of the detected face in this image i'm going to store those coordinates in the x y w and h parameters and let's get the zero index value of the faces variable which is that here detected face is going to be image and pass y2 y plus h x2 x plus w let's plot the detected face now plt.imshow and pass detected face here as seen this is the detected face and we can handle the
blue problem just like that. Notice that the both age and gender prediction models are based on VGG model and its expected input size is 224 times 224. Let's resize the detected face. OpenCV.resize and pass detected face here and pass its expected input size. Now we can confirm the shape of the detected face is 224 times 224. But cafe model expects the input size in the reverse direction. I mean that that's the expected input shape of the cafe model. We can handle this just like that. Detected face blob is going to be opencv dot deep neural networks dot blob from image and here pass detected face. Now let's see the shape of the detected face blob. Now it's just the uh, same as expected input size. Input is ready and we can pass this input to the pre-trained models which are age model dot we are going to set its input as detected face blob and then h model dot forward that's going to be the h result similarly i'm going to pass the detected face blob to gender model as well i'm going to set its input detected face blob and gender model dot forward and this is going to be the gender result. See the gender result first. It returns an array consisting of two items. If the maximum one is the first one, then it's going to be a woman. If the maximum one is the second one, then it's going to be a man. That's why I'm going to import numpy. And here I'm going to check the maximum one numpy dot argument max returns zero if this is zero then it's a woman otherwise it's a man this one is a woman in my case now let's see the age result it's an array and Let's check at length. It returns 101 shaped array. And let's remember the values of those array. In the reference study, it's expected to multiply the value of each item to the its index. I mean that we will multiply this value to 0, this value to 1, and this value to Hundreds. I can handle this multiplication operation just like that for i in range from 0 to 101 and here get i value and store this in a numpy array those are the indexes now I'm going to multiply h result and indexes then apply numpy sum function here it returns 36 that's the age of the fat image we can round it uh, that's the apparent age let's see the apparent age in a different cell this one is almost 37 years old Let's test this notebook for a different input image. For example, let's pass image 30 and restart the notebook, clear its all outputs and run all. This is Matt Damon and this is the detected face of Matt Damon and it's a man and it's 30 years old. So, we have mentioned how to make age and gender prediction with OpenCV in Python. 
Thank you all for watching and see you next time.